hello there today i'm going to be sharing with you all some hairstyles which are appropriate for office for college and some are even appropriate for school i know the struggle is real when you go to an indian school their hairstyles oh my god they're so 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 difficult to choose so i've put together these 5 minute hairstyles which are heat free easy and cute to do and i hope you will like all of these hairstyles which i've put together for you because i'm not that good with hair so without further ado let go Start off by combing your hair bottom up. This reduces any damage and will get you not free hair. So for the first hairstyle, I'm just gonna take all of my hair to the back of my head and I'm gonna hold it with my hands in a ponytail, a low ponytail. You can even go for a high ponytail, but I personally like the low one for this. And I'm just gonna take a rubber band and I'm just gonna tie my hair in a ponytail, like you can see right here. It's easy, no science at all. So once I'm done with that, I'm just gonna take out my bangs, which need serious trimming, but I'm just liking them long at the moment. because i feel they look a bit more classy and sassy so i'm just going to take them out and after that i'm going to take a section of my hair from the ponytail like so and i'm going to twist it with my fingers as you can see and then i'm going to wrap it around the base of my ponytail to hide the rubber band as well as to make the ponytail a little bit more sassy and classy and all of those good things so i'm just wrapping it around the ponytail and it looks so cute and i'm going to take a bobby pin and stick it right into this twist to make sure that my twist stays in place and it It makes my pony look oh so cute and we're done with the first hairstyle wasn't that easy and cute and yeah it's just so easy you can add to this hairstyle by taking all of your bangs up like so and pinching them together between your fingers and raising them in a puff or a poof and then just pinning it down with the help of bobby pins if your poof is a little bit you know uneven you can just use a rat tail comb to make it even like i am doing right here by just tugging my hair and then all you need to do is just comb it out to make sure it's all perfect and i'm just taking out some face framing pieces because i like it like that and this is such a polished look perfect for school as well because no teacher will say uh mm huh -hmm, girl to you in this then you can just take out your ponytail first by taking off your bobby pin and then you can just take out your ponytail and you have a classy hairdo for you know your office so just comb out your hair to make it nice and neat and in, in place and you are good to go to your conference meeting with clients for the next hairstyle i've just taken out a middle parting and i look like this so yes i'm just going to use my bangs because they're long if your bangs are not long enough you can also incorporate like bigger sections and then i'm just dividing it into three sections like so and i am braiding it through this is so cute and i'm also going to make sure that it's towards my head because if you braid it onto your face it will not go back so yes After I'm done with that I'm just going to pick up a section of hair and I'm going to pin my braid under it so that my pin doesn't show and I'm just going to place my hair on top of it like that then I'm going to do the same thing exact same thing to the other side and with the power of editing we are here so I'm just going to comb out my hair to make sure my hair looks perfect and cute and I love this hairstyle it's perfect for college and a boho look so all I'm going to do for the next hairstyle is I'm going to take all of my hair to the back of my head and again I'm going to make a pony but I'm not going to loop through the second loop i'm just going to let my hair like that in her half way and with all the hair left i'm just going to wrap it around the base of the ponytail to make sure that the rubber band doesn't show and again i'm just going to take a bobby pin and stick it right in to make sure my hair or bobby pin like stays in place and that will give you such a cute little you know updo right there or low do right there i love it it looks so cute next up i'm just going to like take out a side parting a heavy side parting and i'm going to take all my hair to one side of the head like so and then i'm going to take another one in section using the rat tail comb and i'm going to split it into two sections and i'm going to twist it into each other and then i'm going to pick up some hair from my head and incorporate into the previous strand and then twist then incorporate into the previous strand and twist there is no rocket science here guys it might look a lot intricate and it will just take you 5 minutes so it is a really nice hairstyle so once i reach to the nape of my head ne neck head wow i'm going to split all my hair into two sections and then i'm just going to twist it together this will make you look like you worked so hard on your hair and once i'm about like reach till the end all i'm going to do is that i'm going to twist this twist around itself this will 
literally make you look like you put in about like an hour into your hair then i'm just gonna use a rubber band to secure the bun like so and i'm also gonna like fluff it out to make sure it looks really cute and chic and nice so this is what i'm left with and i love it i like like love all the hairstyles let me know which one do you like the most and which you will be trying out so yes for the next hairstyle i'm gonna take out a parting again like you can see and once i'm done with that i'm just going to just place my hair up behind and then i'm going to take out two sections longer sections and i'm going to take a hair tie which matches my hair color i'm going to take both of these sections to the back of my head and i'm going to tie it with this hair tie which matches my hair and is not visible because of the fact it's so thin and cute and you know just nice so once i'm done with that i'm going to flip this strand around itself twice to make sure it gives me a really cute sort of like half abduish princess abduish which i love this is such an easy look but it's so cute so cute guys i love the way it makes my head look all right for the next uh, hairstyle i'm just going to take all of my hair and i'm going to flip it through and i'm going to pick up a chunk of hair like so and i'm going to divide it into three sections and i'm going to braid it first making sure it goes upwards towards my head and once i'm done with a few stitches i'm going to bring it forward because my hands were hurting so yes i'm just going to bring it forward and continue braiding it till i am quiet down so once i'm done with braiding i'm going to take a hair tie which matches my hair color and i'm just going to you know secure it it doesn't really matter which hair tie you use so it's not not a big deal and then i'm just going to fluff out the ponytail to make it like the braid to make it messy and then i'm going to incorporate that braid into my hair and make a high ponytail like so i'm going to keep it messy deliberately because i want it to be a messy look so i'm just then going to make my hair into a ponytail like you can see it doesn't need to be neat or anything because this is a messy updo and then i'm just going to let go of that braid to make sure that it's not a braided thing and then i'm going to take my pony and wrap it around itself and with the help of lip bobby pins i'm just going to secure my bun into place and obviously pluff it out mess it up because i love it like that and face framing pieces to the rescue and this is so cute you guys this is so intricate it looks like oh my gosh you worked so hard but in, but you know what you didn't so yes with that i finished all my hairstyles i hope you guys enjoyed these and if you did then please rate comment and subscribe i think these are so perfect and cute as i said for office for college and even for your school let me know which one was your favorite and do not forget to follow me on all social media all of them would be in the bottom bar and i will see you guys day after tomorrow till then you know you have to take care of yourself i love you so much guys and yes bye